เดี๋ยวพี่ชนโอ้กระปุกอีกอู้อู้อู้อู้เยสเยสเยสโอ้กนอีกนอีโอ้ยอ้ยอ้ยไปส่งไปส่งไปส่งเฮ้ยวันนี้สวัสดีทุกคนมาต่อกันอีกครั้งนะครับกับผมเรนดี้ฟิชชิ่งผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่าไมโครโฟนมีปัญหาแล้วคุณเห็นไหมตอนนี้ในห้องนี้ผมกำลังร้องอยู่ตอนนี้เพราะว่า Uh, MQ was busy that day. We didn't able to match the exact day to go out kayak fishing together with Nordic uh, fish on SG. So yeah, just trying out, find some grouper, find some rainbow jack maybe, and mainly, but mainly is we'll be hunting for grouper. And yeah, whatever. We'll launch the kayak and let's get into the video. Okay, guys, lancho, lancho. Ah, uh, kali ini grouper aku kat atas topi. So I'm not sure you guys boleh dengar ke tak uh, suara aku Aku cuba tengok lah video kali ni tengok Jerit jerit ni <laughs> Aduh Ni hey, siapa siapa macam tempat ni ni pasir gudang ni Kan Malaysia ni aku nak balik <laughs> So lah ni bau kuih 12 uh, Air masih tinggi lagi belum bau nak start surut So nak casting grouper tu boleh tapi Agak payah sikit lah sebab ayat tinggi kan Kalau rendah sikit lebih senang sikit Nak kas tepi-tepi Kat, kat batu-batu uh, tempat tu So kita Guna macam biasa Pakai rumpang udang tu cari tengok Kat bottom-bottom ada ke tak kan? So Jom-jom-jom yeah. uh, let's go A little longer than a few minutes later. เดี๋ยวพี่ชนโอ้กระปุกอีกกระปุกไก่อ๋เดี๋ยวกลัวเดี๋ยวกลัวเดี๋ยวกลัวโอ้ yes ล่ะกระปุกตามือไก่ปลาแบบเปิด yes กระปุกตามือไก่ปลาแบบปลาแบบเปิดยามบีโอเค Ni dia guys <laughs> Grupa pertama Tengah aku ketak je <laughs> Gila oh, Lama best gila ni Ni size sedap ni Boleh lah First fish of the day boys On the Rapala Shark Dancer Dia size 7 oh, Tengah aku ketak gila oh, Tengah dia masuk batu ni Bila oh, aku Oh kena ikat lane Okay, kita cuba lagi Yes, yes, yes. Oh, can I eat? Can I eat? Oh, 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 โอ้ลมา
Tuh dia. Bisa <laughs> sekilo ni. Oh. Holy crap man. That was insane. Oh no no. Oi oi oi. Dah 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 dah. Oh. Nak kaki aku terketak. <laughs> Nah, ha, luring. Kedah oh. Oh, Dua ekor. Padu tadi dia tekan ambil kat depan aja. Ha. Tuk in front ni. Wah. Ya. badan Yes lah Sangkut 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 Oh dapat Oh dapat bumi Bumi Ini bumi <laughs> Oh yo Tak kena Ada 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 Dia dekat ada Ada Dekat situ je Cuba lagi Cuba lagi Slow sikit hmm, Ini batu Eh, dah kena. Ui, kena lagi. Ha, tu dia. Ha, kena lagi. Ha. Oh dia ambil tadi. Tu oh, dia masuk. Masuk kayu, ah uh, masuk batu tadi. Ha uh, sini ada tepi kayu ni. Oyo. Putus. Dia makan kat sini je. Spot a lot of money. Korang boleh guna Yang aku guna crankbait ni Yang ni Rapala Shad Dancer uh, Size 7 Dia tak ada bunyi tau Tapi warna dia cerah Sesuai untuk tempat-tempat macam ni tau Sebab dia cerah Kalau kor korang guna tak ada clacking Tak ada bunyi rattling kat dalam Kalau korang guna warna yang lebih cerah lah Kalau guna clacking tu senang sikit lah Sebab clacking bunyi boleh Attract mereka uh, Untuk keluar tengok kan dalam dalam batu-batu ke apa ke. Ni aku pun tak sangka ni boleh dapat banyak gila. <laughs> ya, ya. Ah, dah kena. Ha ah, tu dia.
Ah. Ah, ada. Tapi yang ni bukan aku yang putus. Tak, tak ada tak ada gewang dekat kat mulut dia. Aku gini ni opas kut. Tak silap ni opas. Saya kau lagi. Mantap guys. Mantap. Alright guys, so yeah, it's already been three hours since then. We reach here around nine o'clock, ten o'clock. Then we slowly kayak all the way to our until here. Somewhere the breaker here for around thirty minutes because we slow slowly uh, pedaling. Then we started to try out some bottom first using the prawn, as the video that you guys just saw. And then not much action for the bottom prawn, so I decided to go for cranking at the side breaker. And then caught plenty, plenty of grouper that you guys just saw just now. Memang banyak lagi lah aku dapat. Apa iko ni aku dapat? Gila. Aduh. Currently, I'm currently using this setup. Uh, Calcutta Conquest 2021 with the uh, pairing with my Mojo Plus as usual my favorite rod. Uh, I'll use different couple of crankbait jet dancer Jack Dip Seven. This is the Opas D Crank 200 Plus. Yeah, whatever. So Nordin actually helping us to bleed the fish. Uh, why we bleed the fish? Because once we bleed the fish, the fishy taste inside the fish will be like reduced a lot. And the meat will become like really nice and white. That's one of the reason like why we bleed the fish sometimes. Some people don't bleed the fish, some people bleed, but there's a good reason for for it if you bleed the fish. Yeah. Right, Nordi? Yeah. Exactly. Ni mai sini, api us ni. Gila rich. Rockung tu. What's your name, love? What you came from? Neck and wrist laced up. Very little makeup. The swims at the Reebok gym tone. Your frame up. All right, guys. So we just reached Pungos Beach right now. Uh, yeah, we just. Nang kapan hari ni? Catch of today. The biggest will be this one. Tapi aku tangan besar ni. Tapi ni sekilo lebih ni. Ni saya sekilo lebih. Ulama. Ni memang paling size ni paling sedap lah ni. Tapi apa yang kau? Lucu dua ekor So Ha nah, tu lah Nordin Nordin dapat tiga Ni semua casting ni Ni semua luring Oh lama Ni lumayan jos <laughs> As usual Nordin will help us to clean up the fish The guts Alright guys, so here comes the end for this episode and yes, we caught plenty, plenty of crab. <laughs> anyway, it was a really, really good session with Fish on FG Nordin and yeah, he Actually, was moving. guiding me along the journey and then he told me like we spot at fish and along with breaker, sometimes at grouper, so because Kai is very convenient. You can, you can move your kayak whatever, how far from the shore that you want. So, yeah. So, whoever interested in kayak fishing, do drop down a message on Fish on Energy. They have, as I mentioned, they have Facebook page, they have Instagram page. I'll put the link down in the description below. So, you guys go and check it out. Do drop down a message if you guys have any interest about it. Alright, guys, so pretty much that's the end for this episode. I hope you guys really enjoy watching this video as much as I do. We'll try to make a quality video, try to make quality content to all the guys to enjoy it at home. You know, I just hope that sometimes, you know, you're having a tough day outside and then you come back home, you saw my video, I just uploaded a new video and then you guys do it, watch it and make your day. That's just what I want, man. So, yeah. So, yeah, make sure you click the like button, okay? And subscribe my channel if you haven't. Join my journey and we see you on the next episode. Thank you.